well, this is a little bit of a harder question because when you compare Vitev versus electric ionizers, pretty simple. All those systems are roughly the same. Minor differences, the processes are all the same, whatever, right? So that's an easy contrast. When you look at us compared to other natural systems or other mineral-based systems that are out there, it's harder simply because there are so many of those products now. Right? You go to Amazon and there's hundreds if not thousands of possibilities that you can order and have drop ship from who knows where by who knows who. Um, but they're out there. So how do, you, how do you know what a good system is? How can you contrast the Vitev lineup versus some of those products? And we can't speak to everyone specifically, but we can give you some rough guidelines. Things that we think you should probably be considering when it comes to choosing what system goes in your home or what you're gonna drink or give your kids or whatever, right? So the first of those is where does the product come from? Who makes it? Uh, our first product in 2010 when we started was called the AlkaStream. We got it out of China. That's who made it for us. And the water was good. It worked pretty well. But the quality of components, the plastics that was in there, the, the fittings themselves, man, those things were cheap and would break. And we knew they were not gonna last over time, right? That's what set us on the course for finding the different manufacturers we have today and the lineup of products that we have. Um, but you gotta know where your product's made and where it's coming from, right? That's the biggest thing. Uh, number two, um, alkaline water is sort of a catch-all word for a, it's really hard to define nowadays. Um, when you look at, if you ask us or look at our products or what we're talking about when we say alkaline water, what we mean is a product that uh, filters really well, at least up to the level that the end consumer, the end drinker wants to have their water filtered to. Uh, it needs to provide uh, mineral rich water. So there's actual mineral content in the water, but there's also a higher pH as a result of those minerals, right? Uh, we want to have an antioxidant water, both at the negative ORP side, as well as the hydrogen side. And we want the product to be simple and easy to use. Okay. So what you got to be concerned about is does the product you're looking at do all those things? Because what we found is there are some products that do a high pH water, but they don't add many minerals to that water. And they probably don't make the antioxidant side of things either, right? Or they'll do minerals and pH, but no antioxidant or pH and antioxidant and no minerals. Or the filtration's really poor on it, or the filtration's really good and therefore it takes forever to get the water into your glass, right? There's, there's, it's hard to come up with a formula and a process that, that makes sure all of those things function the way they should function. And that's what we've set out to do from the beginning because and this leads into the third thing, we use our products, <laughs> both in the warehouse, in our homes, our kids drink them, right? We, we know how the products function. We came up with these products, we came up with the recipe, so if you have an issue, you have a question, you're concerned about how it's going to install in your home or whatever, we can speak with authority to those issues. We know how the products work. We know what they're made from. We know what the ingredients are and we know what the user experience is like. So when you've got an issue, when you have a question, you're gonna to talk to people who actually know what they're talking about. So quality construction, a broad, simple, easy to drink water that covers all the bases that we're looking for and people who know what they're talking about.